God, we are so grateful to you for your love for us. Thank you for manifesting your love towards us in sending Jesus Christ, who came to give his life that we may live, that we may be reconciled to God. For this, Lord, we are grateful, eternally grateful. We praise you, we thank you in the name of Jesus. We ask, Lord, that you speak to our hearts through the word of God. Let this word change us. Let this word meet needs. Transform us by the power of your word in the name of Jesus. And for all that you do, Lord, we'll be careful to give you alone all the glory and all the praise in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Praise God. I want to title today's teaching, Perfect Protection. Perfect Protection. For those who are not here, for the past two weeks, I've been teaching about the ministry of angels. We see in the Bible how God uh, sends angels, his angels, to watch over us. Uh, but I want to include more than just the ministry of angels because God does protect his people. with more uh, that's a blessing amen. amen so let's look at that subject perfect protection I'm going to start from Psalm 91 uh, we already saw this but uh, let's go back to it and uh, look at verse 11 Psalm 91 and verse 11. And I'm going to. Uh, can Judge, you have it? Yes, Judge, please. Psalm 91. Psalm 91, verse 11. For he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways. Amen. Actually, uh, let's start from verse 9 and we go to 12. Because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the most high thy habitation, there shall no evil before before thee, neither shall any plague come nigh, nigh thy dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over thee, to keep thee in all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in thy, their, their hands, lest thou dash th thy foot against a stone. Amen. He provides protection for his people uh, through the ministry of angels. I taught a lot about that last week, and we've revisited that today. You see here that the Lord himself will be your refuge. The Lord himself will be.